What's up everyone, welcome back to some more Final Fantasy Tactics 1.3 Insane Difficulty. This is Joe from I Might Need This Later, a gamer's podcast. So in the last episode, we beat the dumb birds in the river, and now we're on our way to Zeltenia Castle to go fight Zalmo 2. Uh, and this is the strategy that we came up with for this fight. So you may notice that there are some ghosts in my in my uh, party formation at this point. Um, the only reason we have those is because uh, while we were off screen, we did some poaching and recruiting just so we can get some more reflect mail. So if, if you poach a revenant uh, using secret hunt support ability um, and then go to the first shop, the common poach for the revenant is a reflect mail. And we wanted a bunch of those for this fight because Zalmo loves to spam holy and his holy hurts a whole heck of a lot. So we're trying to get rid of that. So this is what we came up with. Uh, we're going with the full evasion build for Ramza with abandoned defense up and float. Uh, float is to dodge the earth slashes from the monks. Uh, same exact build for Dutois. Uh, Defender, elf mantle, abandoned defense up, float. Pretty much everyone's going to have the evasion build plus float um, with item. Uh, same thing here, but she has attack up instead of defense up because she's going to be hopefully our main damage dealer. And then last but not least, we're going to bring our boy Hitoshi, Hitoshi to this fight. Uh, he's probably going to die a lot because he doesn't have the evasion build, but he has weapon guard, so anything from the front uh, he should be good with. Uh, just a matter of making sure he doesn't get hit from the side. So he's going to have the Reflect Mail as well as Concentrate so he can get off some good Night Swords. And mainly we were bringing him for Dark Sword to knock the MP out of some of the Sages and Zalmo himself. So that's the setup, and here we go. Alright, so we're going to meet up with Delita here in Zeltenia Castle, uh, at the church rather, and he's going to tell us all about the the plot to murder Larg and Goltana and um, how he's not working for the church, but he's still following the high priest plot to a T because it's going to further advance his own goals, which are to, um, just like everyone else was doing, use Ovelia to prop himself up to the throne. So that's his ultimate goal. Like, Delito wants to crown himself a king. So we'll try to get through this text as quick as possible. So Delito goes over his real plan, which is to assassinate... Um, both Larg and Goltana to try and get the masses to stop fighting um, and use the church as a mediator, basically putting the church in power. However, Delita, supposedly working for the church, but really isn't, um, says that, yeah, that's the plot, but I have something else cooking behind the scenes with Ovelia. Um, we both want the same things, meaning he and, and Ramza, and they won't be enemies as long as they continue wanting the same things. And then Mr. Zalmo shows up and wants to capture us again. And he's just as annoying the second time around as he is the first time. So I thought about trying different ways to um, assassinate him on this fight. But there's some items that he has that I really want. So we're going to go get them. Uh, as far as formation, let's do this. Um, Dutwa here, Connor here. Um, who else do we want to bring? That's right, we're bringing um, Onion Knight and Hitoshi. Uh, yeah, that looks fine. Let's go with that. Sure, why not? And we get the the help of Delita on this fight, thankfully. However, he doesn't have as much evade as the rest of us, so he dies pretty quickly because these monks, they have attack up plus, plus power sleeves, and they have a lot of PA. So their wave fists and their earth slashes do a ton of damage. In one of my practice runs of this fight, uh, the first turn of the battle, Delita got hit with a 603 damage wave fist from one of the monks and instantly exploded. So that's how powerful these monks are. Uh, thankfully, they're, they're fairly frail, um, so we can do quite a bit of damage to them, but the problem is that they all have item, or they all have revive, or they all have a way to full life somebody. Like, there's all kinds of different ways that they have to get everybody up. Plus, is almost just running around hitting everyone with M barrier, which is a problem in its own right. Alright, so Delita, please don't die in the first round. It's happened several times where he just keels over in the first round. 238, yeah, it's pretty good damage. All right, so this sage is going to do us. He's a Virgo. We have pretty good compatibility with most of our guys. What are you going to do? He is casting... Looks like he's casting Flare at Delita. 
What is he doing? Uh, he is casting Gravity 2. The focus there on Delita. Interesting. Okay. Alright, that's fine, I suppose. Are you guys going to walk into this gravity while he's doing that? That would be bold of you. Yeah, he's really thinking about it. He doesn't know what to do now, because the squares that he wants to go to are covered up by a spell. So he is... What is he casting? Is that slow? I don't know what that is. Oh, her poor... The Onion Knight's getting wave-fisted. Ow, oh, that hurt. I guess he has Concentrate, because we should we have 100% evasion, or as close to it as we can. So let's see what this guy's casting. He is casting Demi-2 onto Delita. So they're both trying to... They're just going after Delita hard. I guess their, uh, their job is to kill him. But whatever. I mean, probably going to happen. I can't really stop it. All right, so... Ramza, what can I do on your turn? What makes sense? If you try to yell, uh, Taylor gets a turn, which I think is the other Sage. So we could get a haste off onto somebody. Who, though? Or we could try and kill this guy, because he's low health already. Uh, he has damage split, 154 health left. Can we just kill him? 176, yeah. So if we get behind him, he should just die. Yeah, he's dead. Okay, cool. So that guy's dead. He's dealt with. Alright, then... I want to start doing damage to these other monks. One, two, three. That looks good. And let's shoot you. 192. I like that. Cool. Alright, M Barrier onto the Sage that's casting. I don't think I can reach him with any Night Sword abilities because he's too far away. But he's not directly casting at us. Alright, so that guy's casting Confused, too. So that one I could probably get something going with. Uh, did he cast it at Connor? Confused 2 is centered on Connor. So if I move and jump, kind of like we did with the Velius fight, then that would that should not hit anybody. Uh, so it goes two out in each direction, if I saw that correctly. Let's take a look at it one more time. Confused 2. Yeah, it looks like it has an effect of total 3, so it goes two out from the center. It's going to be mindful of it. So where does Connor want to go to? If I go there, then it hits our both guys right there. If I go here, it doesn't hit anybody, but are we in range to jump? One, two, three, four, five. And then that guy is at 40 CD. Yeah, we can jump on him. Okay, so we just got to be mindful of what squares we're standing on while he's jumping. So that's only going to do 99. That's not very good. All right, so one, two, three... And we can't hit anybody with anything from there. One, two, three. Nope, that won't work either. Okay, so what we can do is... I guess we just move up and we heal our Onion Knight. Let's do that. And then Hitoshi... So that's going to drop him under 100. We could probably finish him off with a Night Sword. Oh, we could finish him off without even the jump. We didn't even need the jump. Alright, well, you're dead. Goodbye. Alright, two monks down. It's a good start. Alright, so this Gravity 2 is going to hit Delita probably. Oh, cool, it missed. Excellent. And then Confused 2 is going to fizzle out because he's in the air. And then Demi 2. Maybe miss? 289? What the heck, man? Goodness gracious, that was a lot of damage. Alright, but well, that missed. That's okay. We did what we wanted was avoid the um, Confusion spell. So what is next? Flare centered on Delita. Okay. The guy's really intent on killing Delita. And you are M casting M Barrier on that monk. Wow, it goes off instantly. Zalmo, you beast! Alright, Delita, go up and hit that guy. Yeah. Oh, I really like what this is going what's going on here. Oh, if you get the crush dead, that would be great. Okay. Even so, that the flare is gonna go off and hit both of those guys, probably. Or the gravity. Yeah, hit yourself. 
Nice. Kills himself. And did a bunch of damage to his monk friend. Oh, that's awesome. So he's just going to take the turn to Chakra himself. That's fine. I'm okay with that. He has re-raise, which is a little bit of a problem, but not that bad for us. Okay, so what is your reaction ability? You have Hamido, so we don't want to punch you. Definitely don't want to punch you, but we don't want you getting past us either. So let's go here and give me your... Yeah, give me your power sleeve. Thank you. All right. Uh, it doesn't matter what we face. All right, shoot this man. 120. That must be bad compatibility. Oh, no, he has the protect and stuff on as well. All right, Sage, what are you doing? Looks like nothing. Cool, nothing. All right, Lancer. One, two. We can't really jump on anyone from here, so we'll just move up. Join the rest of the team. All right, we can try and get a slow on this guy. One, two, three. And we, we effectively block him off unless he can jump over us. So let's speed ruin him. 93%. Yeah, I like that. Beautiful. So even though he has the M barrier stuff on him, we slowed him. That should be good enough for now. Um, what next? I guess we go here and we try and kill him. So Night Sword does 64. That's laughable. Uh, I don't want to blood suck him because then things are going to get weird. I guess we just Night Sword him then. Whatever. 64 damage is 64 damage. Every little bit counts. He shouldn't be able to jump over our heads now to get to revive his guys. I mean, he'll find a way, I'm sure, but... Alright, so... Why was that zero? Let me see why that was zero. Oh, because he's re-raising. Okay, so what is he doing? Is he casting M Barrier on him? He must be casting M Barrier. Yep, okay, because he knew he was going to pop up. That's okay. This is what they do. As long as we can block them off from these other two monks, I think we can kind of whittle them down slowly. It's just a matter of making sure that they can't jump over us, but I have a feeling he can. Um, if I move here, I don't think he can jump over. Yeah, I think I'm just going to move here. I really don't want him jumping over our heads. Okay, so let's go here. What can we do from this square? We can yell. Taylor and then Norton go. Who's Taylor? Are you Taylor? And then you're Norton. Okay, so if we don't we don't want to get caught mid-charge because that's gonna hurt. So we will just sit here. And then you can shoot him again. And then stay where you are. Yeah, I definitely don't want that monk jumping over us. So I'm trying to block off all the squares. Alright, what's your CT at? You're at 100, so you're going to get your turn momentarily. Again, I just want to kind of block off some squares. Let's see what he's going to do. Yeah, he can't get over it. He's going to just chakra him and his friend. Okay, that I'm okay with. Yeah, so we just need to keep blocking these squares, and hopefully that one monk will crystallize. The other one can't. It looks like he's got either heroic gloves or just is a story reason. I don't know. Alright, so that is what confused to or is that flare i didn't see so that is confused to hitoshi will get a turn before him so we're gonna we're definitely gonna night sword him all right zalmo what do you do you're gonna m barrier the sage yep m barrier for the sage okay um so Let's go here, and let's try and get another slow. Or we could just magic ruin you now. Now, we'll, we'll let Hitoshi do it. 93% for slow. Let's do it. And we're still blocking off these squares from the monk. Don't want him jumping over our heads. Alright, Hitoshi. Dark Sword. Oh, it only drops 80 MP. It must be bad compatibility. Maybe we can... Let's... Maybe we could blood suck him. I mean, that's probably not the best idea. But it would stop his cast, wouldn't it? Because I don't want this Confuse going off. How much does how much MP does Confuse cost? 
I honestly don't know. Do you have Sage unlocked? You do. Okay, so what does Confuse 2 cost? One second. One more time. Let's look at that again. Sage. Confuse 2 is 20 MP. Like maybe I should have. So, if we hit this, you'll be down to 50. You still cast it. Alright, I guess let's try to turn you into a vampire. I don't know, this could go this could go either way, man. Alright, cool. So we stopped the cast, but he's a vampire now. Which could be good or bad for us? I don't know, because he might bite us. He might bite his friends. I mean, we do have item with Holy Waters as a backup. Oh, what do we do with you now? So I, st I don't want to get off this square because that means that the guy will jump over us, I think. Uh, if we yell on four, Taylor goes. Who's Taylor? Is that this guy? Yeah, so I don't think it matters if he mid-charges us. So we'll yell. Who do I want to yell at? Yell at Hitoshi? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, let's yell at Hitoshi. Okay, wait in place. Onion Knight, you get a turn. You can't shoot anybody from these squares. And I don't want you to move up and get bit, but if you go here, you're safe. So let's bring Delita back to life. Since you've got a turn that you can't really do anything on. Alright, what's your plan, Taylor Sage? Flare, it looks like, or gravity. Can't tell. Okay. One, two, three, four. Yep, let's go up here. And jump on some heads. Cool. Do it. Alright, yell on Hitoshi. That's cool. Can Hitoshi get a turn before that spell goes off? Doesn't look like it. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, nice miss. Come on, more misses. Nice. Cool. Alright, this is the big one right here. Nice. Alright. Five for five. Awesome. Okay, cool. Whew, that was scary. Alright, Hitoshi. I don't want you getting blood sucked by this guy. I also need to do... Yeah, I want to... I want to get rid of this guy's MP. Let's go here. Dark Sword. Yep, that's gone. Awesome. So far, so good. Alright, Zelma, what's your plan? Your plan is to cast Holy at Delita. Okay, well, he's dead. No coming back from that. Alright, we're still blocking off these squares. Because I don't want those monks coming back to life until... Or actually, I don't want them coming back at all, obviously. Alright, who's next? You are next. Alright, this this guy is scaring me, man. You're slowed, you're slowed. Alright, can't get in range to slow you. But we can move up and res Delita again. Alright, let's do it. Delita, up. Keep blocking these squares off. Just slowly squeezing the life out of them. Alright, that... Okay, that didn't break the chain in anything, so that's good. Alright, we can move the, the wall up a little bit now, because it looks like we've got it covered on that end now. Uh, and I can go safely, I guess. I don't want to get blood sucked is the problem. I don't want anyone to get blood sucked, but it's probably going to happen. Can I just kill this guy? 248. He has protect and all that stuff on? Yeah, he has protect and shell. Hmm. What do we want to do? Who is he going to blood suck? That's the question, right? Alright, Aranza. This guy is what? Zodiac. He's a Virgo to our Ares. So he's neutral. Oh, he doesn't even have anything that we want to steal. We already took his armor. We took his clothes already. This guy has no MP, but he's still hasted. 
And what reaction ability does he have? He has HP Restore. Okay, so we don't really have the ability to hit him either without sending him back to full health. Unless... Man, this... This, <laughs> this vampire in front of me is real spooky. Alright, I guess if, if Ramza gets bloodsucked, at least his turn's already over. And I can fix it on my turn. So HP Restore, 128. That'll drop him to... Uh, 141. That should not put him into critical. So let's do it. Okay, cool. Alright. Sage did nothing. He just stood in place. Alright. What are we doing now? I guess we move up and shoot this monk. Oh, this is getting real spooky. All right, who's he? Okay, he did nothing. Great. Oof. Okay. I don't know why he did nothing, but I'm okay with it. Earth Slash, killing Delita. Yep. Okay. Well, at least you tried, Delita. Slowly squeezing the life away from them. Okay, so if I go here, I can hit this guy, but I don't know if I can do enough damage. I'm actually in range right now for a Night Sword, so 96, that'll put him into critical. Death Strike, that would put him into critical too. 64 doesn't do anything for us. Zalmo goes next. How much MP do you have, Zalmo? 178, you still have a ton. I don't want to break this chain, because if I move up too far... Uh, actually, if I go here, we're okay still. This would not be a bad spot. How could, he can't get around us. Yeah, because he can't go around Ramza. So Ramza's blocking that spot off. So we can do this. We can try to go for a second blood. Oh, that, that seems too scary for me. Too spooky for me. Alright, we'll just Night Sword him. Cool. And we'll go this way. Alright, Zalmo, what's the plan? You are... I don't know what that is. Hey, that's one crystal. Alright, I said give me a turn, please. Alright, what are you casting, Zalmo? You are casting Rejuvenate. Okay, I mean, that's fine. Cool. Alright, Connor. Uh, he's already on 56 CT. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yep, you can jump on the Monk. Just squeeze them for everything they got. Alright, that guy's dead. Oh, maybe not because of the Rejuvenate. Ugh. That vampire is spooky again. Is he going to bounce off and heal him again? Okay, cool. Okay, regen is gone. Haste is gone. Alright. Can we slow you? Can't tell if you're already slow or not. We're just gonna do it anyway. Let's keep everybody slow. Alright, your plan is what? Do nothing. Okay, so if I move from here, that breaks the line. So I think I'm gonna stay put. And we can yell. Okay, so we can yell at... Is Satoshi hasted or not? I can't tell. Oh, there. So he is hasted. So let's... Yell at our Onion Knight. That guy is really close to dying. Okay, can we finish him with this? Yes. Goodbye. I mean, he's got re raise so goodbye for the moment. Okay, so I still don't want to break the line here. Alright, that guy has all of his stuff gone. What do I do with him? Is my Phoenix down him? Does, that doesn't do anything. 
So that still heals him. So he's a vampire, and so healing items don't do damage to him. Um, does this break the line? Yeah, it breaks the line if I move. But if I go here, I can't hit anybody. But he gets free. I mean, he's already free as it is. I can't stop him from moving if I wanted to. I kind of need to stay in this spot. But I have nobody that I can attack. Hmm. I kind of wish that he and Dutois could... That the Onion Knight and Dutois could switch spots. Alright, I guess we just wait in place, because... I mean, this is the... We just need to keep this line until we fully dead them and they don't come back. Alright, so he's casting M Barrier, it looks like, after the guy re-raises. Which is expected. Okay, where are you going? Oh, is it time to suck our blood? Nope, okay, cool. So far, that's, that whole blood suck thing is working out for us. I suppose. I'm surprised he hasn't bit anybody yet. I'm kind of curious as to why. I, to be honest, I, I don't fully understand the mechanics behind the blood suck or why or who they target, if anyone. Alright, Patricia. Alright, we can move up to here. That still holds the line. And then we should be able to get a jump. Nope, he's on 70. What about you? 83. But we can move this way. Actually, no, I kind of like where we're at. I don't really want to move. Yeah, we'll just stay where we're at. Seems like a safe spot. And then five on that. So Taylor and Norton would go. So this guy's going to get a turn. Unless... What's your reaction? All right, it's aimed though. So I can't, I can't hit him because he has... 74 brave, so 74% chance to negate my attack and beat me down. So what I can do... I guess I can just throw a rock at him. May as well, right? Gotta do something. Eat that, buddy. No, I don't want to move. I would like to wait in place, please. Okay, so... Next thing to do is break the speed on you again. You need to keep you slow. Alright, what's your plan, Sage? So you have moved MP up, which is kind of cool. Alright, can we kill you? Yeah, we can. Okay, cool. So we're going to kill him again. He'll re-raise again. Yeah, so we just keep waiting. Yeah, so there goes his re-raise. There goes the chakra again, and then Zalmo's probably gonna M barrier again. I mean, that's what I would do if I were Zalmo. Yep, there he goes. We just gotta wait this out, pretty much. All right, what's the plan here? What are you doing? Oh god, don't bite me! Oh, there it is. It begins. The biting begins. All right, we can get we can get rid of that, but doing so would break our line, I think. Um, no, okay, we can we can safely get rid of it right here. Okay, holy water. Spooky vampire. All right, 65 CT, 57. All right, let's move up towards this guy. Block him off on this angle. Alright. What are you doing? Are you casting Demi? I don't know what you're casting. But let's throw another... Oh, he's casting, but he can still Hamdo through casting. Gamido, whatever it's called. Uh, yelling. So he's casting slow. Okay. Then Dutois would go. Then Taylor, who is the Sage, I believe. Yeah. Okay, we can get a yell off. Put it on Hitoshi. Yeah, 
Or maybe I should have put it on Dutois if he's going to get slowed. But I think he's going to block it. Yeah, yeah, it reflects right off of him. Cool. That's right, I forgot that we had Reflect Mail on. So he slowed the Vampire, which is fine by me. And then we're going to Speed Ruin him again. I'm just taking this nice and slow. You just got to drain them out. Make sure that he can't get by me to resurrect that monk. Alright, so now we can move in even tighter. Right up on him, but then we can't shoot him. Hmm. How do I want to do this? Okay, so she, she's got that part of the line right there. I could... I can move over to relieve Hitoshi. So he can move? Yeah, so he, he'll be able to move now if I do this. Alright, what are you going to cast? Confusion. Okay. So, you're slowed. Zalmo, what do I want to do with you? I think I want to start draining your MP. I think I can safely move to there. Yeah, because if you try to move, you go one, two, and then you're stuck. You can't go past these guys. Okay. So let's go here. Dark Sword. Give me your magic. Let's expedite this process a bit. All right. Split punch. Nice block. Okay, he's gonna run away. Is Connor gonna get a turn? Nope. Confuse is gonna go off. I mean, if it hits, whatever. Connor's just kind of been standing up top there as a bodyguard. Alright, you. So you can go back a step and still hold this line. Shoot this man. What are you doing, Connor? Wasting my holy water. I don't have very many of those. I might need them. Okay, so he's got Amido still. Can I throw a rock at you? No, I can't hit you from here. I'd love to hit you with a rock. Does heal have a vertical tolerance? Vertical 2. Okay. So if I close in a little more... What's our turn order looking like? Fink goes next, which is, I think, the, the monk. No, it's Fink. Oh, Fink is the, the vampire. So, who goes after that? Hitoshi Norton goes after that. So I would need to go... If I go here... That's okay, because he can't get past the tree. Okay, let's close in. Throw stone. Yeah, we can hit him. Cool. Broke the confusion. Alright. Don't bite me. Don't you do it. No. No, I don't want it. Gross. All right, Hitoshi, give him the water. Okay, what's your plan? Sigma magic. Oh, he's not a vampire anymore. Okay, that's that's kind of okay. I'm kind of okay with that. It was really weird trying to balance around that. Alright, Zelmo is doing what? Casting Confuse. Alright, good miss. Alright, attack this man. Oh, he has Hamido. Alright, well, I guess Speed Ruin. Very nice. Keep them slow. Alright, uh, well, 
30, 35. Okay, so we'll get turns before they do. Yeah, we might have to back up a little bit to make this work. Yeah, what are you doing? Is it more confuse? Are you reflecting something? You're reflecting explosion off me. Okay, cool. 55. Alright, what is your speed, Mr. Sage? You have 10 speed to my 9, so you needed 50. Okay, can't do that. But we can jump on you. Or we can... Hmm. Really wish that you were more useful right now, Connor. Really wish you were more useful. This guy has Hamido, right? No, he has HP of Sword. 132 with that. A jump would be 198. Alright. Well, let's jump on him. Alright, Hitoshi. Does this guy have any MP? He sure does. Alright, let's get rid of most of it. I don't want you casting things. And then move right there to block it off. I guess I could need to start trying to attack through this Hamido. Oh, we missed an 80%. That was unfortunate. Oh, Zalmo, I forgot you had Chakra. Thought we were done with your MP. Yep, more chakra stuff. Just can't get rid of this guy. I've killed him like three times and just wasn't he won't stay down. Alright. Speed ruin him again. Just keep them slow. Keep shooting them. Are you going to confuse us again? <laughs> no, he's going for a, a gravity too. Alright, this guy's got some MP back. And he has teleport. That's confuse, for sure. Oh. Well, we got to try to go for this. Right? Yeah, that sucks. I really tried. Mido is really good against us right now. Alright, well, we blocked it. Alright, Hitoshi. Can we keep blocking? Yeah, one, two, three. Yep, let's go here. And then we can get a Night Sword off. I might be able to kill him. Ugh, 120. What about Death Strike? Death Strike will do it. Okay, cool. No casting. Alright, Zelmo. Pick him up. I already know you're going to. Nope, you're just going to try and confuse us some more. Nice block. I swear we're almost there. We just need to get this monk down. Alright. 50 CT. I think we can get a jump on this guy now. 10 speed, yep, 50 is exactly what we want. Let's move. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yep, we can jump from this corner. 242, that's a good that's good damage. Alright, Dutois, move in. Now this guy is fully cornered, can't go anywhere. And let's just try and hit him. Yep. We're just gonna keep trying. Alright. 1, 2, 3. Let's shoot him. And he's back up. <laughs> thanks for the chakra. I appreciate it. Hitoshi's MP thanks you. Ooh, 
Ooh, you gonna try and poke us in the back? Nope. You're going for gravity two. Okay. All right, I guess we can start moving out now with Ramza. What can he do though? Can't really do anything other than throw a rock at him. All right, how long until that cast goes off? So Zalmo, so Hitoshi will get a turn. But that means that he'll have to move, so I need to be there to block this guy in. Um, so I would need to be... Ooh, he can get away, actually. He's at a good spot where he can get away if I move Hitoshi. So how do I prevent him from moving? 30 CT. Okay, so Patricia will get a turn first. So will... But she can't kill him. Hmm. Don't want him running. All right, can I throw a rock from here? No, it won't hit. So he's there. If I go here, then he can go and get to there. Don't want him escaping. That's like the worst case scenario. If that guy gets free and starts resurrecting people. I think I just have to let this gravity cast go off. Um, well, Patricia's going to get a turn first, right? So we can... Worst case scenario, we can move her up one spot. So if we keep her there, and I go here... Will Dutois get a turn first? 52, yeah. So Dutois will get a turn first. I could put Patricia here. I just need to be within three of this guy. One, two, three. So I need to put Hitoshi there. And then I can go here. Okay, so let's go here. And let's yell. Yep, let's yell at Hitoshi. Alright, Zalmo gets a turn. What's he gonna do? Is he gonna try and confuse us some more? Oh, he's gonna attack us in the back. Is that a rejuvenate? I think it's a rejuvenate. Oh, this guy. Forgot that he was coming back up. We gotta deal with him, too. All right. Well, I guess I guess we got to go here and then pick a pick an item. So 192 does not kill. I don't think we can unholy explosion him because it's too high. I guess we have to dark sword. Okay. I guess so. Just don't want that gravity going off and having things get all messed up. Ah, so this guy heals himself some more. So annoying. We'll get there. This long, tedious process. Yeah, I just gotta keep Hitoshi hasted, because he's doing a lot of our work right now, along with Patricia. Oh, that guy can get, in, can get out right now, actually. Ooh, I didn't block that off. That was a mistake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the reflex. Hey, thanks for the heal. I don't think I needed it, though. Okay, Connor. He's on 70 CT. 55. 44. Okay. Let's jump on... Oh, that's going to cause HP Restore to go off. I think we can... What's your speed? 10? 10. Okay, so we can't jump on you. You're still on 10 speed also. I guess all we can do is... I wish we had enough jump to move down there. We can jump on Zalmo? No, that damage split is worthless. Uh, HP restore is the worst. All right, so I guess we just keep waiting. All right, you can get an attack off. 192 80 97 okay so I need to move you here to block this route off 
and then we can shoot you. Alright, are you still slow or no? You have float, not slow. Okay. Speed ruin. Yet again. This fight would have gone a lot faster if this guy just didn't have Hamido. Because I could have killed him a long time ago. Alright, he can't go anywhere. He's stuck in this little square. Is he casting haste? What is he casting? Is that flare again? What are we casting? I confused two, but Hitoshi gets a turn first. That's fine. We actually, a bunch of us get turns. Uh, and then he's casting haste two. Okay. Alright, Zelmo, what's the plan? Chakra? Probably, right? Yeah. We're gonna get you guys eventually. Waiting for the right turn order to come. There we go. So if we. Nope. We death strike you to death? So that would kill you. But then we're gonna get hit with Confuse 2. I think. Alright, do we have anyone else that can stop that? So Connor does go, but he's not going to be able to stop it. What do I want going off more? So the haste is only going to be on himself and the sage. So I don't care if that goes off. I think I care more about the confused messing things up. Um, but I don't want him escaping again. One, two, alright, we got to do it. Stop with the casting. Alright, Connor. Alright, jump on his head. He's done for. Okay, so we can move up now, because he is very dead. I mean, we can even try to make it official. Yeah, he still gets the Hamido off. Alright. Is that another Confuse? Probably is. It's gotta be, right? Ugh. I stopped one Confuse too, just for another one to go off. That was huge. Awesome. Come on, Hitoshi. Guard. Nah. You tried your best, Hitoshi. All right, haste two. I'm not so worried about because I can I can get rid of that with with Dutwa with his breaks. Oh, we got haste two. I I like that. Okay, so you're dead for sure. I can't get into a spot to kill you, but I can. Who goes next? Actually, Connor's jump, and then Fink. This guy goes. Okay, but he doesn't have any MP, so I don't really care what he does. I just don't want him to get this crystal, so maybe I walk back there. One, two. Yeah, I can't get. I need to get on Hitoshi Square. Or oh, whatever. I'll just shoot Hitoshi. Please don't kill him. 192, that's fine. I can live that. Okay. You're dead. Stay down this time. You gonna try and poke me? You 10% poked me. Okay. Alright, first things first. Stop being fast. We missed a 93! How'd that happen? Crush punch. That misses too, good. Alright, we're almost ready to start cornering you, Zalmo. You running back for the crystal? You trying to go around the... Around the back on us. Alright, I don't want to... Gosh, you're so annoying. Didn't do anything with this guy. Nope. Alright. Well. I don't want to hit my own person. But maybe I can undead him and then he definitely isn't coming back. Hmm. 
What's the percent chance that I hit my friend? Oh, it's 100%. Even with Abandon, it's a 100% chance to hit. Interesting. Why is that? Oh, because Concentrate. I have Concentrate. That's right. Alright, well, I don't want to Bloodsuck you. That seems a little over the top. So we'll just Night Sword again. And we will wait in place. Alright, Rams it. Run back. Start. Go grab that crystal. Now it's starting to scare me that they might grab it. Go here. Shoot you. We're almost there. This guy's almost down. Uh, I don't think I can jump on him. Definitely can't jump on him, but we can get here to block them off. So he can't come down this way. He's just going to cast more Confuse at me. Yeah, I definitely need to get on the back side of this church now to make sure that I can grab the crystal before any of them do. Cool. Nice block. Alright. What is your plan? Nice block. Okay, this guy's at 100... He's at 76 health. Okay. Please die. Thank you. You are very dead. Okay. Zalmo. Is this a holy strike? Is that what we were doing right here? Yep. Well, that was going to do a bunch of damage. Alright, do toi. Run back towards the crystal. Okay, start. Let's lure Zalmo down here. I, I want to be able to corner him in the same area that we just cornered this monk in, if possible. Alright, we can get Delita up now. Delita can come join the party again. Wake up, Delita. Napping on the job, buddy. Don't worry, we'll save you. Oh, you're going to grab the crystal? That's fine. Whatever, man. Okay, you. I guess just attack Zalmo. Doesn't really do anything. Oh, he has damage split. Just stay there. Don't do anything. Dark Sword. All right, Zalmo. The end is nigh. All right, Sage, you are... You're going to cast another Confuse at us? Nope, you're doing nothing. All right. I guess we start going up. I really wanted Zalmo to come down this way, but I kind of blocked him in. Maybe I will unblock him. Oh, wait, he's going to do more chakra stuff. Maybe I just try to pincer him on the roof, if that's possible. Uh, well, I can't get up there unless I go all the way around with you. All right, let's let's chase you guys down. All right, you're still on sixty something CP. Oh, Delita, what are you doing? Oh, he's gonna haste himself. <clears throat> so apparently Delita gets the yell ability, which I thought was exclusive to Ramza, but apparently not. All right, you. No, you can't yell at her. Okay. But I guess we should yell at Dutois so that he can get his slow butt up there. Now, before we kill Zalmo, I definitely want to steal some stuff from him, mainly his shield. Uh, he's got a Venetian shield, which is 50% physical evade, 30 or 35% uh, magic evade, and it halves fire, ice, and lightning. Like, it's a really good shield. Like, I definitely want it, especially for all the abandoned evasion builds we've been doing uh, probably would be very handy he's gonna frog me I don't think so yeah I'm not a fan of being the frog no thanks buddy give me those HP or give me those MP rather 
Not today, buddy. All right, Zalmo. Going that away. Yes, chasing you up to the top. You're bouncing a ref what are you reflecting off of us? Full life, cool. All right, whose turn is it? All right, so we're going to stop that. Hmm, that's bouncing a full life off of us onto who? So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. That's really cool, Zalmo. Really freaking cool. Can I stop it? One, two, three. Maybe I can. Magic Ruin. 75%. Okay. I like those odds. Oof. Okay. That almost got scary. I don't want that guy coming back. And I think since he's on zero now, he'll crystallize before Zalmo gets to do it again. What are you doing, Delita? Okay, that's fine. Scared me for a second there. Alright, Zalmo is almost chased onto the ledge here. Okay, let's stay here. We've got him cornered. Can't go anywhere. The only way out is through our Lancer at the moment. Alright. Yeah, we can't shoot him just yet. We need to keep coming around. Man, this fight... This fight got weird in a hurry, man. There's vampires... Kind of using, like... Battle of the Bastards tactics on him, where we just kind of surround him on all sides and... and get him from a... and just crush him into a corner. Kind of cool, actually. Kind of cool. I really enjoyed that. Nice dodge. Alright, so we just gotta kill the Sage two more times, because he's got re rays. Alright, we can't. We're not in range of anything here, so we gotta move up. Everyone to the top. Thank you for the haste, Alita. You've been minorly useful for the moment. Uh, you can stay here, I guess, and pick up the stuff. Feather boots. We didn't need those. We just need to get rams up there. I want to get the shield. That's, like, the one thing I definitely want. Uh, we should be able to shoot this from here. Oh, yeah. That's going to trigger HP. Oh, no, it doesn't. Cool, it doesn't knock him into critical. Excellent. Alright, get up there. All right, you can't go anywhere, Zalmo. Almost there. Can we finish him before he does the rejuvenate stuff? 144. Yep. Sit down, buddy. I know you have re-rays, but... We'll be back. We'll kill you again. Alright, go ahead and poke him a little bit. Yep, damage split, fine. Alright, that guy crystallized. Oh, he treasure boxed. There's only one guy on the field that's not named Zalmo. Oh, I mean, there is that one monk that can't crystallize. I think he has heroic gloves. Like, I have to believe that's what he has. Alright, where are you going? You're going right there. I think we can shoot you dead still. Yep, go pick this up. What'd we get? Hey, black costume. That's pretty good. I like that. I don't think that's going to save you, buddy. I'm pretty sure it's not. One forty-four just misses, but this will get you. Okay, Death Strike, you're dead. 
Zalmo can't save you now, unless he reflects off of us, which I'm sure he'll try. <laughs> He's gonna confuse us. Oh no. Thanks, Zalmo. Alright, you. Just shoot him. Stop him from being confused. Alright. About that time. I need all of your stuff, Zalmo. Right, let's put you over here just in case Zalmo tries some funny business with this monk. Um, I guess let's shoot Delita. We don't need him anymore. I don't know why we picked him up. We didn't need him. Chakra. Yes, we know. I'm just gonna keep dark sorting you. Alright, get in the corner, Zalmo. Yep, there you go. Okay, so you go here. Dark sword. Give me that. Okay, Aranza. Now we have him in a corner. Now we're going to go through the painstaking process of stealing, trying to steal his shield with 23%. It's going to take a while, but we'll get it. I just don't want Delita coming up in here, killing him or anything. So let's jump on Delita's head. Alright, you can stay down there. I don't need you to do anything. Actually, you can... Stay here just in case. Just in case you get some MP, you can you can drop them. All right, twenty three percent chance to get the shield. How long will it take? Oh, he's we're gonna get him mid charge. Nice. How much is this gonna do? Three hundred sixty. Nice. I mean, thanks for hasting me and all, but... Time for me to jump on you. Alright. Give me all the MP. You're not allowed to have any. Alright. Here we go. Come on. Not armor. Shield. 23%. We got it. Ugh, oh, come on. We're gonna get it. Zalmo, my dude. I know you really want this MP, but it's not gonna happen. You got this guy behind you. Oh, can't really hit you. 49%. We'll try. Yeah, we missed. Does not matter, though. <clears> hmm. <throat> okay, it's fine. You go ahead and chakra, we'll shoot you. I mean, I guess we can start jumping on him now. Can't go anywhere. Alright, sit down, Delita. Keep knocking that MP out. Pretty much the only thing we have left to do is just steal all of his stuff and then finish him out. I hope it does not take as long as I think it's going to take. His damage split really sucks. Alright. Steal that shield. We're going to get it eventually. Alright, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to put a little cut in the video uh, and take some time to steal all of his stuff, and then we'll be back in just a moment. So, I'll be back. Bye! Okay, we are back. Uh, we we <laughs> took all of Zalmo's stuff out of him. It took a little bit because of the 23% chance with a 
to get the Venetian shield, but we were able to pick him clean. So now all we got to do is just finish him off. So we're going to do that right now. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, so we want to move out of here. I don't know if we want to let him out, but we're going to move out of here. Because I want to get that crystal, that's the sage crystal, onto Ramza. Because uh, he has unlocked sage, so maybe he can get some goodies out of it. And plus I want to be able to shoot this guy with our onion knight. Alright, you can stay there. Onion knight. Can we shoot him from anywhere? It would have to be here to shoot him, and I can't. Oh wait, maybe I can shoot him. One, two... Maybe I can shoot him from here. We'll try. Yeah, yeah. All right, I mean, damage split's still gonna be annoying, but we'll get there. Oh yeah, we tried to jump on him, I forgot. <laughs> All right, Hitoshi, just keep draining his MP. He can't regen anymore because he doesn't have the light robe. We took that off his body. Just a matter of finishing him off. You just gonna stand there in chakra. Cool. Fine with me. And we jump. Alright, pick up this crystal, see if we can get something nice from it. Oh, look at all that. Rejuvenate, spirit search, shell, spell absorb, zombie. Threaten, death spell to, frog to, gravity to, zombie to, confuse to, sleep to, despair to. Pretty much all of the level 2 spells for Sage we just picked up. That's really cool. Let's take those. Alright, you. He's on a spot we can't shoot him. Okay, well, Hitoshi, I'm going to need you to move, buddy. Uh, actually, I can't really have him move. Uh, keep dark sorting him. And then I guess we'll just move in here so we just keep getting consistent jumps on him. I don't know what'll be better for us. Jumps or shooting him. Ideally both, but I don't think we can get both. And you're out of position to do anything. Um, whatever, let's throw a rock at you. You're gonna... Oh, we can't even get you with that. So, I guess we need to yell at somebody. I guess we'll yell at you since we need to get more jumps off. This is gonna be slow. Maybe I just need to get Hitoshi out of there and have him stand behind so we can shoot. Because we're getting nowhere right now. Absolutely nowhere. Um, now we would need to be here. I guess we'll go here and we, no, we don't even have anything to heal our onion with. Ugh, damage split. Somehow Zalmo's still gonna win, I feel it. He's gonna find a way. Oh, he's gonna end barrier himself. Here he goes. He's going infinite. Um... Sure. Let's go here and shoot him. So the problem is 139. He damage splits 216. That's 108 to us. We can live that. We're hurt, but we can live it. Oh, there's the regen and all that good stuff again. Alright, maybe we need to get you up here. For swinging, swinging your sword around. All right, Ramsey, get in there. Attack this man. It's the first time the damage split didn't go off. Instant jump, nice. More chakra plus regen. Yep, I guess we gotta do damage. 57. 
54. No, we just gotta dark sword him again. Oh, uh, Zalmo, you're so annoying. Uh, I think we can get a jump before your turn. Just so we can block you in for the jump. And then we'll Mega Potion. Maybe I'll equip change and try and beat him down with something else. That might seem more effective. Yeah, let's let's do that actually. Let's make use of the useless equip change. He tried to punch us. Alright, so the only one that can't do damage to him at this current moment is Ramza. And Dutois, but he's just staying down there. Oh, he's really trying to punch us. Alright, keep jumping. You. Night Sword. God, that does no damage. 48. And you're going to damage split some of it? No, I guess not. All right, let's equip change into something else. So let's change this into a slasher. That's what, 14 attack power? Maybe. 15 attack power with that. Go with a defender for 16 attack power. What do we want to hit him with? Oh, we can go with the dragon rod. Yeah, let's go with the dragon rod. And then we'll wait and beat him down next turn. Can't wait for him to be done with this whole protect shell nonsense. I hope I get a Bahamut proc. That would be cool. Yep, he's just going to keep trying to punch us. He can't kill us in one punch, so I'm not too worried about it, but I should Mega Potion because he's going to damage split when we hit him. This is as slow as it gets, my my friends. Okay, here we go. Ooh, he got us with the 27 damage split. Alright, I just want the Onion Knight to go so she can drag and run this guy in the face. Yeah, hit him. 91% chance. Nice, and we got the Bahamut proc. That'll speed things up. It's so bright. Probably gonna do like 90 damage. I'm gonna be so sad at how little damage it does. 87, that was close. It's still 187 damage though, and he didn't damage split it, so that's even better news. Damage splits the jump. We're getting kinda low. Alright, let's get him up here to heal some people. Alright, we're at 190. Is that... 256, I think. Yep, 256. We're gonna get there. Just a matter of time. He's so tanky. Alright, Shell and Protector finally gone. Jump on his head. There we go, 132, that's better. Alright. Yell at the Onion Knight again. Alright. Attack him with your stick. Bahamut. Ah, it didn't go off. Jump should finish, though. Oh my god, we've done it, guys. We beat him. He died, finally. Oh god. Please punish the wicked. No, you're the wicked ones, Almo. Jeez. Guy refused to die. 
35,000 gil, plus some stuff that we don't need. I mean, crystal shield is fine, but we didn't really need it. Holy crap, that was a long fight. Fights are just getting longer and longer as we get further and further into the game. Alright, more story stuff. Cool. Elita, thanks for being not very useful. What are you going to do, Joe? I had two reasons for coming to Zeltenia. One was to see you. The other is to see Count Orlando. Thunder God Sid? I want his cooperation to uncover the church's plot. How? I have strong proof that will uncover the wrongdoing. The Dramatic Scriptures! Yes. When I met Olan, the Count's son-in-law, he promised if I had proof, he would stop the High Priest's conspiracy. Olan, huh? Who is this? It's okay, she's one of us. Several people were sent from Muron to help me. She's one of them. Help? More like keep an eye on you. Hey, come on. She knows everything. She's the only one we can trust in the Goltana army. You're the youngest Beal, Joe, right? My name is Balmofula. Nice to meet you. And what do you want? The Hokuten are moving. Is Fort Bethel the target? Ken Orlando left for Bethel a while ago. Goltan is heading for Bethel along with your Black Sheep Knights. A little too late. The battle won't end. I'm not giving up. I'll persuade the Count before any more die. I guess it's goodbye, Joe. Stay alive, Delita. You too. I wish he would just come with us. I really like Delita as a character. You're letting him go? I know what he'll do. So apparently it was in the cards that Delita's supposed to kill us. But, thankfully, he did not. I guess I guess the story wouldn't be great if he did right there. You even use your friends. Shut up, what do you know? Okay, I guess I'll just leave. I hate people like you. Get out of here. Alright, so thank goodness that fight is over. Can't stand that fight. Alright, we are back on the world map, and we have uncovered Bed Desert and Bethel Garrison. So Bed Desert is just another assassination mission where we have to go beat down Mr. Balk, the guy with the guns. Uh, but we are going to save that one for the next episode, so... I will see you guys next time. And remember, if you liked everything that you saw here, please give us a like and subscribe, all that good stuff. Social media is on the right-hand side, and as always, links to the podcast are in the description below. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!